Hello, dear friends. Today, in this second chapter of the beginner's informations, we deal with the left hand only. We don't need the bow, we play pizzicato instead. We'll have a look at the neck positions where we use the four fingers. Number one, number two, number three, and number four. Our cello is tuned in fifth. We have the open strings C, G, D, and A. By putting the fingers on the strings, we shorten it, and by that, we get higher pitches. In order to play a scale or any piece of music, we have to shorten the strings at certain points. Our musical system knows whole tones and half tones. We are in the fortunate situation that the natural distance between our fingers is more or less exactly the distance between a note and the next half tone. Try to hold your hand as natural as possible. Your wrist is relatively straight and the fingers you put on the right side of the string. Don't put them directly on the string. A little bit on the right side. Your thumb is depending on its length behind your first and second finger and it touches the neck gently. Do not press. Never with your thumb against the neck. Now we have tone and the next finger, as I said, plays a half tone higher. Here we have E and F. The next finger is again a half tone higher, F, F sharp, and the next finger again a half tone higher, F sharp, G. If we omit one finger, we play whole tones, E, F sharp, or F, G. If we play just one four, E, G, then we have a minor third. Our scales, major or minor scales, consist of combinations of whole tones and half tones. Let us start working on a major scale. A major scale consists of two identically built groups of four notes, two tetrachords. They are very easy to perform on our instrument. You have the open string, the C. Then you have a whole tone, another whole tone, and a half tone. And then the same thing, same pattern, on the G string, two. Open string, whole tone, whole tone, half tone. Altogether, here is your major scale. In this case, C major. I tell you the notes. It is C, D, E, F. Now, G, A, B, C. Now you do the same thing starting on G, G, A, B, C, D, E, F sharp, G, and that is your G major scale. And finally you start on the D string, play D major, D, E, F sharp, G, A, B, C sharp, D, and back. Now you are able to play easy uh, songs. Maybe you know that.